We got to get now to that deadly shooting spree in Florida that left three people dead in Orlando, including a nine year old girl and a TV news reporter. Police arrested a 19 year old man. He is expected to be charged in all three deaths. Raina Roy reports. A day long shooting spree in Orlando, leaving three people dead and others wounded. First UV advisory and multiple gunshot wound calls in the Highway Street area of the previous call. The first victim, a 38 year old woman, shot and killed around 11 a.m. on Wednesday. A TV news crew reporting on that shooting, then becoming the target themselves hours later. A local reporter and photographer from Spectrum News 13 shot while simply doing their jobs. At some point around 4 o'clock, he returns to the scene. Um, he goes to the vehicle where the news media people are at. Uh, he shoots uh, both the people from News 13. Reporter Dylan Lyons died from his injuries. He was engaged to be married and would have turned 25 years old next month. Dylan was a go-getter. He uh, always wanted to learn, was always eager to get better. It's so tragic and heartbreaking that family after family has to deal with the outfall of all of this. Authorities say the gunman identified as 19 year old Keith Melvin Moses later walked into a nearby home and shot a mother and her nine year old daughter. The nine year old died. Mom is in critical condition. He has a lengthy criminal history to include gun charges, aggravated, and aggravated battery and assault uh, with a deadly weapon, burglary and grand theft charges. No one in our community, not a mother, not a nine year old, and certainly not news professionals should become the victim of gun violence in our community. Spectrum News has released a statement as their newsroom copes with this tragedy, saying in part, we are deeply saddened by the loss of our colleague and the other lives senselessly taken. This is a terrible tragedy for the Orlando community. Rena Roy, ABC News, New York.